Uh, hi, in this video we will see how to deal with the problem of uh, heteroscedicity in our uh, particular example. We have seen that um, um, in uh, our model there is some evidence of uh, heteroscedicity. Uh, this is something that we were able to see after uh, the visual um, analysis and after running the brush pattern test. And uh, next thing what you have to do is when you uh, have uh, an evidence for heteroscedicity is to, to do some uh, um, modifications in your model that will uh, make uh, the model uh, be free of uh, heteroscedicity. And uh, after running our visual analysis, so we were able to make a conclusion that um, um, there is uh, some evidence that uh, our residual is uh, correlated with uh, uh, advertising and uh, its uh, square term. Therefore, what uh, we will uh, do here is uh, uh, we will transform the model by dividing uh, the model th um, with the square root of um, advertising square or just uh, with um, advertising. But before we uh, do this, we will generate some uh, new variables. We will generate a constant which will basically be equal to uh, advertising. Then uh, we will uh, generate uh, the, uh, the term uh, which will be one over your advertising so const uh, star uh, and uh, this is equal to one divided by constant and uh, next uh, we will uh, generate the terms um, of um, we will generate sales over advertising and um, price over advertising So what we've done here basically is uh, generated new variables, so uh, which are our old variables divided by uh, advertising. Now we will uh, run uh, the regression. Uh, but with this modification where uh, price is modified to, to where sales is modified to sales. Uh, and this will be our new uh, dependent variable and uh, we'll run it on uh, constant const uh, star uh, price Great. So this is our regression with uh, the usual standard errors and now we will rerun the regression with um, uh, 
robust standard errors so we will choose the option robust for our standard errors and uh, uh, here you can see that uh, nothing has changed in terms of the significance of our uh, new uh, variables and uh, you can uh, um, see that the standard errors of uh, price star and constant star in our uh, model with the uh, standard and robust errors do not uh, uh, differ uh, very much so you can uh, conclude that you have solved the problem of uh, heteroscedicity to some extent by uh, this uh, modification in your model.